what is good youtube welcome back to a new video it's been quite a minute since i made another airsoft gun review or bb gun or gel blaster but here i am back with another airsoft pistol this gun is gonna be green gas and as you can see it's by we tech box is pretty plain both sides have we tech Top and bottom. You get those little warnings and stuff. Made in Taiwan. Alright, let's get into the gun itself. Alright, here we got the instructions manual. As you can see, that's an M9. M9 Beretta. But this is a Calico Jack M9, and this is how you get it in the package. You can see it doesn't have styrofoam like some other guns do. Uh, kind of has that uh, that material that the the eggs come in, uh, something like that. But they do uh, pack it in this plastic bag. All weight tech guns come packed in one of these bags. Alright, so this these bags will give the gun secure protection. Uh, you know, none of no scratching, uh, no breaking, none of that. This bag is very strong. It helps it, you know, to stay safe at all costs, so it won't end up breaking uh, during shipping. So that is pretty good from WeTech. <laughs> Alright. Here we go. This is a Calico Jack M9. As you can see. Very beautiful pistol right here. It's got like three different colors. It's got gold grips. Got the Calico Jack on the grips right there. On both sides. You got the slide in a silver color and on the very front is like a like a rose gold or bronze something like that and just a little bit of it same thing with the top of the slide and then you do get your safety right there gotta pull it down to have it on safety so you can't misfire it is ambidextrous so you can select the safety from both sides so that is a plus. Gun is very weighty since it is uh, almost all metal. Besides your grips, these are going to be plastic. So that is kind of a downside. Um, but other than that, the slide and frame on the bottom is all metal. The gas magazine is all metal as well. You load in the gas from the bottom. As you can see, the sights, line them up right there. They're just uh, three white dots. So that is pretty nice. That's pretty good sights. We got this gun is made in Taiwan. Uh, it's full metal besides the grips, like I said. Now you can't take it down from here. Um, I'll probably do that in a second. But first, I'm going to get to the chrono shooting. So here I have the Ace Tech chronograph. Uh, I need to put it on the point two. Point. Point. Point twenty. I had it on the twelves. All right. All right. Here we go. Point twenty. Let's see. First shot. Oh yeah. And I forgot to mention. If I try to pull the trigger, it won't shoot. Got to take it off safety. Now it will shoot. So <laughs> there's that. 
I know there's other guns that you yeah, gotta rack the slider back for it to shoot. It's so, alright, here we go. First shot, see how much it chronos. Three thirty point one. Three thirty eight point eight. Three twenty eight. Gonna take three more shots. 327 323.6 one more shot 321.8 so that's around the 330s 320s that this uh, Calico Jack M9 by Weetech is shooting. So it's pretty good for a gas pistol. It isn't too bad. Since it is a full blowback gun. So I'm going to take a couple shots down range over there. Alright, here we go. See that blowback action? It looks like it's already out of gas. Didn't go through the full magazine. Now this gun isn't very good at... Uh, consuming gas I mean it's very good at consuming gas but it's not good at you know getting a lot of shots for the amount of gas you put in the magazine so I'm gonna load it up with more gas got the Eli force fuel gotta load it up again gotta shake up the green gas like so Put it upside down, fill that up till it's all juiced up. Hold it in for like seven to ten seconds. Repeat like three to five times. No, I did a I didn't mention that I did get a extra magazine with this gun, but I don't have it with me because it stopped working. I've had this gun for quite some time in my collection, but the other magazine stopped working, so that is a that isn't great. The O ring started leaking; it probably broke or something. And I only have one magazine, which is a bummer, because I was gonna use this, you know, for airsoft wars, but now I can't. I only have one magazine, and I gotta either buy a new one or figure out where to get the O rings, which is honestly a pain in the ass, because you can't find any O rings in reality. I mean, there is. But to get the correct size is a problem. Ordering them online and then, you know, shops don't really have them when they're for other stuff. So it's kind of just better to get the magazine. Magazines do run for like about $30, I would say, $35, almost $40, I believe. It's kind of not worth it because it's expensive. But all right, here you go. See if I can get more shots. Now, you switch it down right there, not all the way to safety. This is all the, this is all the way to safety, and it decocks, uh, decocks the hammer. But here in the middle, it does have full auto. So here we go. Gonna let it rip. Alright. Um, seems like it's out of gas again, or something. Oh no, it went down all the way to safety again for some reason. So it's kind of easy to switch it down to safety. All right, here we go. Slide does lock back after the flash shot. And that is pretty nice. Glock 18C to me does shoot faster. And then the Galaxy G series pistol also shoots faster. This one shoots pretty quick. So it is pretty nice. Gonna get another magazine loaded up. 
A little same magazine, but pouring in the BBs. Let's do another. All right, here we go. Another round of full auto. Just like that. It's out of gas. It didn't lock back. So hey. It's it's a pretty good gun. The magazines is where it's at, where later it starts having problems with the leaking and all that. So that kind of sucks. But other than that, it's a great gun. Uh, the price is a little high, honestly, for what you get. But I mean, it is a very beautiful pistol in my mind. An M9, the Calico Jack. I might get the Sword Cutlass one as well, but who knows. But yeah, that is pretty much it with this Airsoft gun review. If you did like this video, make sure to hit that like button and hit that subscribe button for more.